In today's video, I was sent a vintage Yu-Gi-Oh 10 to open on the channel. What's up guys, we're back with another epic vintage 10 opening. I think there's also more stuff because we have a box right here. Right here. This contains a viewer's packs that he wants me to open that contains vintage stuff. So first of all, there's a return label. We're not going to throw that on the on there. We're going to throw that over there. Thanks for the return label, by the way. That was super clutch. Then we have a note. Hey, Ruxin, sorry about the delay. Life's been a little crazy. I threw in some extra stuff for you to open as well. Hopefully you can break my bad luck I've been having. Wish me luck in the comments. Whack job. So whack job. I'm trying to remember what what not stream he was on. He was on one of the whatnot streams and he went like 0 for 5 or something like that. He didn't pull anything good. So he said, hey, how about you? Uh, how about I send you this 10? I've been having terrible luck. Maybe you can break it, which I was like, well, I opened it before and you still didn't pull anything. So I'm not sure if I'm going to break it or not, but I'll do my best. All right. So the first item he sent was a very exciting item. He said, would you be willing to open this for me? And I said, definitely. I love this item that you have. And this item I will not be saying until I show you, but it's taped in bubble wrap. Wait one sec. We'll get it out. We have a Genzo. 10. I was about to say first ad. It's not first ad. Genzo, check this out. I mean, oh my goodness. Classic. A little beat up. You know, it's got some, it's got ripped on the corners a little bit, ripped on the back. I can feel it. But this is a classic 2003 10. We have not opened in a very long time. So I'm super excited. It's going to be super fun. A little hole right there. Going to be super fun. That's not it. There's more stuff. What else did Whack Job send us? Oh, we got a giveaway. Don't worry, guys. Giveaway coming here. All right, here it is. Let's try not to chop it open. Uh, is there a better way to open this? Oh, it's in a top loader, so that's good. Let's just uh, very carefully. I sharpened this knife a little bit a second ago, so it should you. Yeah, there we go. Ooh, nothing like sharpening a knife. There we go. Ooh, Ghost Rare. Is that it? Yeah, it looks like everything. Ghost Rare, Wing Dragon of Raw, Sphere Mode in the giveaway. All you have to do is like the video, be subscribed, turn on notifications. Let me know down below how awesome Whack Job is and thank him for letting us open this on the channel and then any other comments you want to add. All right, he also sent us some what appears to be a Rarity Collection blisters, which we are not ever going to be unexcited about Rarity Collection. Maybe something else at the front too. What is this? Oh, a Mega 10 2018 pack. That's kind of fun. And it looks like maybe five of these, five Rarity Collection blisters. Okay, that's super cool. We're going to pull him a Ash Blossom Quarter Century. And then these look like Stardust Overdrive and uh, Ancient Prophecy Special Editions. Oh, yeah, now we're talking. Okay, so this is going to be super fun. I mean, that's some good stuff right there. We're going to leave those back there. We're going to open up this uh, somewhat newer stuff. I mean, 2018 was six years ago, so not very new. <laughs> Let's see what we can get for a whack job. I don't even know. I don't think 2018 has anything like super crazy. Uh, but we're hoping we get something. Let's see. F.A. We have Duck Dummy. Uh, Sylvan Princess. Ooh, Skull Dread. Saryuja. That was a big card back then. We have Trickstar Candina and a Twilight Eraser. So, ooh, Samurai Skull. That's a classic Duel Links card. Love that. Orbital Hydrolander. Also pretty awesome. All right. Starting it off. Not too bad. Saryuja. Not good really anymore. It might even be like limited or something. I don't remember if it got banned or not, but I feel like it did. Uh, so I don't know if it would be good if it came back or not, but been a while since it's been popular pendulum paradox not as good as this are you ja? and then trickstar black cat bat black cat bat and backup soldier so ooh, temple of the mind's eye that was an annoying card with the weevil burn deck weevil burn deck in uh, everybody say it dual links let's go okay 2018's out of the way rarity collection time in a blister pack let's see what we can get five cards of glory will there be a 25th anniversary card. Okay, if it was, it would be right here. So we're just going to do that. We've got a Pot of Extravagance, Eldritch, Triple Tactic Talents, not bad. Vision Hero Ferris and Inspector Borders. So some great cards in there, but not the cards we are searching for. So far, Whack Job is continuing his streak of not pulling the crazy stuff. Let's see if we can turn that around right here. First edition. We have Dogmatica, Triple Tactics Talents. Cherbini and a junk speeder with a little bit of a crimping on the bottom. Okay. Oh, and a pot of prosperity. That's not bad. Pot of prosperity is a great card. A few dollars worth. Very, very solid. But so far, no ultis, no or prismatic ultis, no prismatic collector rares, and no quarter century secret rares. We are starting it off a little slow. But guess what? It only takes one pack. Come on, whack job. You got to believe. Oh, yeah, let's do make it. Let's do all the supers to the front like that. Boom, like that. Ghost Bell. Alpha, Pot of Prosperity, that's a good pull. Eldritch and Junk Speeder. So a couple Pot of Prosperity out of like three packs is pretty good. Got to pull something big. I and mean, we've got a couple of Pot of Prosperities. It's not bad, but we got to get at least one high rarity card, right? 
One high rarity card. Let's just get these ordered correctly. Herald of the Arc Light, Ash Blossom. We're getting good cards. I mean, it's rarity. You're going to get good cards. Speaking of rarity, Rarity Collection 2 is coming out in like a month and a half, and we have pre orders down below with Sassy Auto. Use my code for 5% off. It's an affiliate link. It supports me. Helps me buy more Rarity Collection 2 because we're completing the set. It's going to be amazing. Uh, Trial Brigade Revolt and Chaos Space. Okay, so last last try at Rarity Collection. Come on. Come on, right now. Give us something good. Give us something good. Give us a quarter center. This one feels thicker. This one feels like it's got some high rarity cards in it, okay? Feels like it's got some high rarity cards. I think it does. I think it does. So this is the super, right? All right. Dingir, so we got Elder Entity. We have Imperm. Man, so many good cards. Okay, no collector rares and no ultimate rares. And... Oh, yes! Intis Quarter Century. So we did get a Quarter Century card. Intis is not like a very like crazy one, but if you're playing the Dogmatica, if you're playing the Dark Magician Dogmatica Invoked, whatever the other one I played, you know, the four the four archetype deck, and then that's pretty clutch. Shadal, there we go. Shadal, forgot about Shadal. Okay, uh, I think we save. Let's do. An let's try for Ancient Fairy Dragon first. All right, chill out, chill out. Start us overdrive. Let's see what we can. Pull. Stardust Overdrive is awaiting, but Ancient Prophecy will bless us first with a Ghost Rare. What is our promo? Let's find out. We have... Ooh, Red Eyes Wyvern. Actually, like, a $6 card last time I checked. I don't think it's had a reprint unless it was in a Speed Duel set, which is possible. They like to reprint old formats and stuff like that in Speed Duel, like Edison. <sighs> Ancient Prophecy. I have pulled a Ghost Rare. I'm pretty sure when we pulled the Ghost Rare for... Was it for EX Gamer? I thought it was out of a Special Edition. I'm pretty sure it was. One, two, three, I think is what we do here. Come on, Emergency Assistant. We have Infernity Beast, Pixie Ring, XX Saber, like a Gura, Genetic Woman, Water Hazard... Oh, no, it was wrong. It's the weird pack trick. XX Saber Fault Troll, which I think you just say X Saber, just to make it easier, but double X Saber Fault Troll. Super rare, not guaranteed in these, so pretty nice. Two more packs, two more chances at the Ghost Room. I mean, Ultimate Rare wouldn't be bad either. We would not be mad. At one point, we had a bunch of Ancient Prophecy that we opened up, but not so much anymore. So we do three, and then here's where the foil would be. So you do a little flippity flip like that. We have Depth Amulet, Ruxin Special, Advanced Draw, Fairy Wind. Hydro Pressure Cannon, Battle of the Elements. Ragagura, back at it again. We have Magnum Bar. Curry Bond and Genetic Woman. So Curry Bond, hey, we got a, we got a Curry Bow, a female Curry Bow. Very cool. <sighs> Ancient Prophecy. Here we go. Last pack magic for Ancient Prophecy. Wait, we have more packs after this, but last pack for Ancient Prophecy. Ghost Rare, here it comes. Kwaki Miru. We have Kwaki Miru. Slip of Fortune. Ancient Leaf. Armored Axon, Brain Research Lab, Sunny Pixie, Gap, Shops of the Baby Gap, and Flam Bell Counter. So over on that one. That's okay. We still got Stardust Overdrive. All right, Stardust Overdrive. So your your buddy there, the Ancient Prophecy, didn't do so hot. Okay, didn't do that great. Let's see if we can put. I don't remember this being in there. What is this? Tag Force Four. Cool, the new uh, the new PSP game. Dude, PSP, who remembers those? Those were awesome. I feel like they did not last as long as they should have. They were pretty amazing. I was a big fan of a PSP. I didn't have one myself, though. Maybe that's why I liked it so much. Tim is Magician. Okay, a little promo. Three booster packs of Stardust Overdrive. Then we get into the Jinzo 10 from 2003. Over 20 years old at this point. Let's see what we can do. One, two, three. I'm guessing it's the weird flippity flip. We have Spida Spida, Ritual of Grace, Reptilian Medusa, Attack Pheromones, A Pointer of the Red Lotus, Ritual Buster, Tuned Magician, Fortune Lady Dark, and Relinquished Spider. Very cool, Relinquished Spider, two packs left. By cool, I mean not that cool because we are looking for foils and we have only gotten one so far, I think. We got the Fall Troll right off the bat, so three. Flippity Flop, do that. We've got Stygian Dirge, Tuned Magician, Spider Spider, Spiritual Forest, Infernity Necromancer, Attack Pheromones, Insect Neglect, the Catabolopass, and the Witch of Fate, okay. And a Metabo Shark, a little Nemo action. Fish are friends, not food, indeed. All right, last Stardust Overdrive. We've got two supers so far. We need to up it to an Ultra Secret, really Secret Ultimate Ghost is what we want. Any of those would be pretty amazing. Ultra still be pretty decent. One, two, three. Flippity flop, floppity flip. Let's see what we can get. When we rip, we have the Synchro, Earthbound, Lemon Impulse, Gorgon, Iron Core Armor, Time Passage, Raging Mad Plants, and... Oh, yes! It happened again! 
and Archlord Christia. Whack job. Your curse has been broken. Okay, this is not the first ad, so it's not this, a $3,000 PSA 10 or whatever, but unlimited, still a $100 card, I think. So, wow, that is nice. And centering looks good on it. Pretty good. It's not perfect. Back looks pretty good. This could be, I mean, a PSA 10 unlimited. I don't know what that would go for, but it's also very useful in Edison. It's part of the value. So I don't know what a PSA 10 would go for, but wow, that is... Okay, two Archlord Christia. This is just like when we pulled Dark Magician Girl at one time and then pulled it again like a month later. I guess Archlord Christia was a couple of months ago, but still, that's insane. That's a rare card. Like, I've opened a ton of Stardust Overdrive and not much since the last one, and we've got two, two like, recently. That's crazy. Oh my gosh, that's an amazing pull. All right, on to the Jinzo 10. I mean, wow, that is amazing. I don't even need my knife because, well, I say that. Let's just find one of those holes back here. Where are they? Or was it at the front? There it is. You can just do that. Okay. Yeah, it's the, that's the thing. When you have a rip in your sealed product, you got to be careful because you might accidentally just open it up like that. Okay. It's pretty hard to do that, but, you know, it could happen. Okay, a little dented there. Not in fantastic condition, but what we get are, you know, you get one variant card. There's my... There's my phone back there. Oh, there I am. What's up, guys? Uh, and then we have a one of each pack. LOB, MRD, MRL, Pharaoh Servant, Labyrinth of Nightmare. Let's go. 2003 opening. Promos are not sealed in any way. They're just sitting at the back of the tin, and usually they're in bad shape. So hopefully this one is not. Let's see. Based on the condition of the tin, I'm guessing it's not in good shape. Okay, there it is. See, it's kind of stuck back there. Let's see. Oh, yeah. Based on that, this is not going to look good. Okay, front. Regular secret rare. So no, like, reverse or anything. Centering's off. Let's see about the back. Yeah, yeah, that's honestly not terrible compared to what it could have been. But Jinzo, this is an amazing, the Tinzo, you remember back in the day. Little foil bleed, though. Check that out at the bottom. You get to see a little secret rare coming through the text box. That's amazing. That's a good looking card. Tinzo, a little weird that it's a secret rare because, you know, Fair Servant was a secret rare, but still very, very awesome and an amazing promo. One of the best ever made. All right, let's get to our five packs. I mean, honestly, that, that was an amazing pull to lead it off. So let's just see if we can get one big pull out of here because this is a 10. A lot. I mean, you guys remember we've opened every 2002, 10, every 2003, 10, every 2004. Go check those out on the opening every playlist that I have. Uh, sometimes they go well, sometimes they go really bad. So let's hope that they do not go badly here for whack job. Okay, Labyrinth of Nightmare, huge shout out because I'm really enjoying this opening. This is some super fun stuff to open up. I love to get to open it up. Free content, good stuff. You guys have stuff you want to send me to open up. Of course, you know, especially if it's old school, uh, then we're definitely interested. I'm trying not to destroy this pack, but it ripped a little weird. Oh, I destroyed it. Okay, that's fine. It happened. One, two, three, four. Four from the back, we have Shining Abyss. This monster employs the power of both light and darkness. Light and darkness, the original chaos monster. Mario Kutai, Portrait Secret, The Dark Door, Aqua Spirit, Spirit Elimination, Skull Lair, Hysteric Fairy, and here we go, give us something big. Mask of Brutality, Loomis and Umbra, playing the Mass Beast Discardius. I don't even remember how they talk. I got to rewatch the OG Yu-Gi-Oh. I know, I've said that for like the last few months, but I'm trying to get Chels to watch with me. It's not that easy to get her to watch Yu-Gi-Oh, but it's going to happen eventually. Just mark my words. She's going to watch it one day. Okay, Pharaoh Servant. One, two, three, four. Can we get a Buster Blader? I'm pretty sure because it's a 10, you probably can't get... Oops. Probably can't get Genzo, but we already got Tenzo, so it's all good. Twin of Fire Dragon, one of my original favorite comments back in the day. Invitation to a Dark Sleep, we have Mystic Probe, Solomon's Law Book, Ruxin Special again, seven completed, Chanted Javelin, Overdrive, Major Riot, can we get a foil here? Let's go, Pharaoh Servant. Ooh, a magical hat, so a very old school card. And speaking of the anime, this one is very prominent. Magical hat, super rare. That is amazing. Okay, got a foil in the tin. That's so check number one. We're, we're not 0 for 5, so that's great. Check number two, we want to get an Ultra. Magic Ruler, as you can see, doesn't have the original logo on any of these. In 2003, they swapped it over from the original logo to the new Red Banner logo, which now has been changed again since then. Okay, one, two, three, four. Can we go back to back foils? We have Snake Fang. Let's get that Relinquish. Let's get Serpent Knight Dragon. Wall Shadow Reverse would be pretty amazing. Stone Ogre, we have uh, Chain Energy. Turtle Oath, Twin Long Rods, Numero Dos, Course of Sanctuary, Mechanical Snail, and we have Painful Choice, another foil. Not an Ultra, but another foil. Two for three, honestly, pretty amazing. Check that out. The sky is very shiny in that card. I like it. I like it a lot. All right. 
Because Metal Raiders is my favorite set, it's going to go last, even though this is Legend of Blue Eyes and we could pull a 2003 LOV Blue Eyes White Dragon, which would be pretty amazing. Let's see if we can do it. We have done it out of a 2003 10 before. Let's try to do it one more time. Not one more time, but one more time. And then again, four from the back. Here we go. Can we get another one? I mean, three in a row is insane in an old 10. Terror of the Terrible. We have Dark Gray, Turtle Tigre, Hard Armor, Frenzied Panda, all common or all uh, normal monsters so far. Silver Fang. Electro Whip. This is the one that's not a short print, I think. Uh, King Fog. Okay, is it the next card? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yes, it is. Give us that blue eyes, white dragon, dark magician, red eyes, Exodia. We take those. Ooh, or a dark hole. So three supers in a row. So we're not pulling ultras, but we are pulling a lot of supers. Spell card, dark hole. Three in a row. That's pretty insane. Can we end it off? Metal Raiders with four out of five. That would be crazy, especially if this is a secret rare or an ultra rare. Here we go. MRD. Bless. Why does this feel like there's not enough cards in here? I don't think there's enough cards in here. One, two, three, four, five, six cards. A six card Metal Raiders pack. Okay, we got gypped a little bit. <laughs> there's not nine cards. Look at this. Okay, six cards. I just pulled it out. Nine cards per pack. What in the world? We got Jip three cards, so I'm guessing none of these are a foil. We're just gonna have to turn around and find out. Okay, no cuts here, no cuts here, uh, Kenneth. Let's just, we wanna show everything because that's weird. All right, Niwatori, what's that mean? Weird chicken, can't, there's a rare cannon soldier. Oh my God, Vicanio Moth! It's blessed, the Vicanio Moth, but you know what else isn't blessed? We only got six cards. We did get the best card in the set though, Vicanio Moth, but Three cards are missing. It looks like we would have gotten a rare anyway, so it's three commons, no big deal, but that is a little weird to see that. An error pack missing three cards. All right, so that was a pretty awesome opening that ended in such a weird way. Thanks again to Whack Job for setting this up. This has been a super fun opening. If you guys enjoyed the video, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. If you want to purchase something from me, make sure you check out Ruxin34.com. Shout out to Tone Fo Show, Puff and Zudum, Ernesto Dan, America Deutscher, KK Beats, Nana Tai Show, Ian Moose, Junior Barning, Robert F., Thomas McLean, Chang Lang, and Aldelso Galicia Jr. Thank you guys for supporting the channel, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.